Salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. Right now, we're taking a look at the Twin Mothers, in which they ain't doing so well against Lanius. He's done very, very well against them, while we're just kind of hanging out here, looking at some dead horses, as I am eyeing a potential invasion of the Foragers under Porter. He can form Colorado, did you know that? I didn't. I really did not. Cool. Anyways, hope you're having a good day. We almost have Omec finished as a focus, and can we core anything around here? Maybe, perhaps. Oh, wow, 15,000. Not a bad idea. Not a bad idea. Cool. We're doing the best we can down here helping defend, but if they give up Twin Mothers, there's really not much we can do. We've got a couple comms to go through as well. I suppose we could do the best and brightest. We finally reached the top of the developmental mountain and are making full use of our mighty, highly curated stock. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Ooh, if you would like to help out down there, go right there. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, three divisions. I should really be helping out over there. Eh, maybe we can still make it over there and help out. Why not? Airplane-wise, we're doing okay. 0.6 damage, not great, but hey, it is something. Oh, you guys actually came back, huh? Uh, let's take a look at this. How much damage has have they done to each other? 4,000 losses. Oh, that's not bad. 11,000, almost 12,000 losses. Not bad. Uh, one of the one, one, not yesterday's video. Oh no, but in, not yesterday's video, but a previous video, like episode one maybe. Someone said to get more money that we should raid other people. Not a bad idea. We could. Since we don't make a lot of money anyways right now, but regardless. The Twin Mothers flee north. The Twin Mothers, are, as a tribe, have seemed to have taught their last lesson. Lanius' forces filling the valley and taking control of the sacred temples and fields. When the time came to finally bring Diane herself out for questioning, the Legion was left empty-handed. Diana would have opened up her true home in paradise to Wastelanders and Twin Mothers refugees, seeking to help from the injuries they took and prepare for a defense against further legionary attacks. Things are getting stranger in Colorado. The Twin Mothers have fled north to paradise after losing their way to Lanius. Well... So fortunate. At least our soldiers are returning home. That is a good, good thing. Uh, we have to wait until 2280, I believe, to go to war with these guys to get this focus done. So, that's quite a long time. But I asked you guys yesterday whether we should do Lunar Sisters at last together or the Full Moon Misguided. So, overall, you guys, with overwhelming support, voted for Lunar Sisters together at last. So, we will... Oh, actually... One of the following must be true. Strength and defeat the Twin Mothers. Oh, we've got a Divisions back victorious. Not a faction with, at peace with Ouroboros. We'll try to get this one. So, eventually we'll have to take over the Twin Mothers core territory. And then we will... Oh, wow. Veterans, nice. Uh, we will, like, liberate them and hopefully add them to our alliance. So, that is the plan. Hopefully it'll work. Wait, should we... Oh! Hold on, they're over here. Wait, what the heck? Why are they at war with these guys? Maybe it's a border war. Maybe it's a border war. Alright, let's go ahead and see what else we can do here. What is this? Okay, yeah, citizen's concern. I was about to core something, but yeah. It was, that says 20% decrease in coring costs. That is so good. That is so good. And they paired us as a... Wow. Look at these resources. Wow. Hopefully they don't do badly or poorly. The tribe destroyed. That is so sad. Vengeance on the Wastes. Strength and Defeat. Protecting Cloud... Oh, or Sanctuary in Paradise. Prepare the nursery for habitation. Clear out the rabble. Ooh. They get some divisions, huh? Learn from our mistakes and Strength and Defeat. Interesting. Every own state. Permanent local 25% reduction in coring costs. Cores all own states also cored by the Black Canyon. Interesting. Clear out the rabble, huh? Well, we'll see what happens. We'll definitely see what happens. I think we are a neighbor of them, I think. But whatever. Let's see. So we did that. I want to see what happens with that stuff. Keeping sharp. That seems okay. Do we finish our land auction already? Oh, yeah. We are finishing it up right now. So that bonus for this stuff is okay. Oh, wait. We already... Oh. Another operative slot. That's not bad. Yeah, that seems okay, though. Let's do wiping out radiation. One of Diana's greatest lessons to Ekate, Ekate, was the dangers of radiation. It's important that we make an effort to try to destroy the invisible enemy we face daily. Very good. We'll of course, stuff soon enough, and it shouldn't take an extreme time much longer to go to war with these guys, but in about three weeks, that's not bad. Cohort declare war on sun dogs. Very good, very good. Ooh, dynamite. That's plenty of dynamite for now. Let's go make sure we keep making more guns and a lot of infantry equipment, crowd control gear, all the good stuff, you know. I'll put over here. Not looking too bad. Let's get up back to 100. That'd be good. For you guys, go ahead and train. 
And what are we going to do here? Uh, let's grab some more energy cells. Flexible designs. Energy cell game per energy would be pretty good. Seed selection. We'll go with plant cultivation. That'd be very good. Mojave Territories, Glitter War of the Fiends. Someone did recommend in the comments from the last video I should play as Mojave Territories. I probably should, actually. I get to play as them, so they seem very interesting, to say the least. Quite interesting. 41. And, and someone did say that make our Spec Ops divisions thicker or better. I did. They were 18 combat width, now they're 20 combat width, so. Already there. Now we have only two divisions holding here. Now let's see what happens. If I do this, when there's only one division guarding each side, will that be okay? Probably not. <laughs> what am I thinking? Thinking that would be good enough. Make sure you get the right area. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 37. Well, actually, they might be holding out pretty darn well. Nice. Scavengers found something. Cool. 27. That's pretty risky over there, but we'll see what happens. Any sort of... Well, I guess technically... I did tell you guys to exercise, so... Yeah. And there is no airbase around here, too, so... Let's go through an airbase right here. Oyaburos. See what happens. Oh, they stopped attacking, actually. That's not bad. This one's slowly going down. Oh, they started attacking again. It's fine, whatever. Richard Wright could use a lot more experience anyway, so... There we go. The Fiends. 24 is not good. 20 is not good. But we'll probably get our soldiers over here quickly enough. If not, we can always force defense or do less stand as well. Only costs 5.72 every time, so go ahead and do that. Why not? Age of Clare, one New Hammond. Very good. There you go. 15 versus 34. Not bad, not great. Ooh, that looks really not good for Diana. Oof. Nursery seeds? Why not? When Akate left the nursery, she was able to smuggle a few seeds out with of it. With these, she had been able to grow a mighty radiation-free forest around Ouroboros. Very nice. Now, with this in mind, come back and attack. Very good. Three guys over here and just train. It's fine. Twice in two lifetimes, Santa Anna's lost his capital. Mexico will lose a tyrant. Not bad. Actually, for all five of you, I'm just going to do this. Boom. And for all six of you, I'll just go do this as well. Just so we can throw these divisions in there whenever we need them. Help, bait them in. Infiltration tactics, and we're done with our line doctrine. We get some reconnaissance, and light special forces get some more soft attack, which is very, very nice. Anything else down here that would be really good? That's not bad. Bomb vulnerability, engineering stuff. Yeah, I'm about to get some complicated secret treats. Already, 2279, everyone. Happy New Year. Happy, happy New Year. Rebuilding the wasteland, every cap for the army. Very good stuff. Oh, Poseidon, we could do that. Arc jet, I'd like that one, though. Mm, nothing too interesting. Toothpick, eh? No, no. Settlement opinion stuff is okay. Eh, we're still building up civilian factories, why not? He seems pretty useful. Citizens' concerns, very good. Attack, and two different types of attack, defense, and organization for our army. Why not? Why not? Cool. And 128 is better than 159 or whatever it was. Might as well core that one too because you get more factories maybe. And soon we take some more political power. 103. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. If we can core as much as we can, that'd be awesome. Oh, Diana, please don't fall. Don't Please don't fail. That would not be good. Go wherever you'd like to, I guess. You're going to come down south. That's fine. We've lost a total of 91 versus 600. That's not enough. Never enough. Are we still training? Hopefully not. Oh, you guys are just kind of hanging out. Flexible designs. Very good. Uh, let's not do that one. Let's grab that one. No, it's a little bit ahead of time. Better planes. Monoplane fighters. Don't mind if we do. And since these guys aren't losing yet even more, we've got some plant cultivation, which instead we'll grab some crop rotations. Very nice. Oh, forges. Wow, that's a good amount of manpower now. 11,000 some. Not bad. Nursery seeds are pretty good. Ooh, infantry. Ninjas, not bad. You know what? We already have recon. Let's get 50% more recon, too. Constructing water mills. The Colorado is not only good for water, but electricity, too. By building water mills, we might not finish this description. Okay, well, whatever. Whatever. Do we get any, like, thing about the Black Canyon? Because it seems they're pretty big in Colorado. Canyon. 
Oh, let's see, Dark Moon Fall, but we're going. We already went this route. On the hunt, it's just all on that side. Okay. All right. Whatever. Whatever. You know what? It's probably more appropriate to do that. There you go. How much money do we not have? Okay, twenty-five thousand. That's not bad. Hmm. Keep going, guys. Keep going. You're doing a great job. Just keep defending. They're doing a great thing. All right. So, should we ties? Uh, uh, I don't think I'm gonna do that to Diana. That'd be kind of mean. All right. Propaganda. War measures. Standards of living. I do like more stability, so let's grab that. Man of Prospectors, drastic measures, not very important. Not very important. Procurement of things, we can wait. Oh, that one's really good to do as well. And another comment. Let's see, make special forces bigger. Also, yeah, I, I totally forgot to bring this one up, but apparently someone said that this focus, Sacking Boulder, this image, is a Yu-Gi-Oh card. I totally didn't realize that when I saw this. It's a Yu-Gi-Oh card, as you should see on the right side of your screen. Um, yeah, that is... I guess the devs got a little bit of inspiration here to have that image. Well, that's kind of cool. Alright, so how much manpower do these guys have? Force trade lots? Well, they're out of manpower. That's good. Thank goodness. What's the next focus? Construct water wells? Water mills? Serpentine doctrines? Oh, we learned some things from the Iron Lines, it seems. Let's prove to the Legion that our Navy is a force to be reckoned with. Well, I wouldn't say our Navy is that spectacular. I mean, it, it, it exists. Sort of. Sort of. Two, three, five. Anyone have upgrades, actually? Oh, you're actually leaving because you were defeated. Ah, uh, Richard Red, you're actually learning something. Survivalist, life giver. Experience soldier loss is probably the way we want to go. Because this infantry, I don't think it applies to special forces. I don't think it is. Don't quote me on that. I'm not really exactly sure, but I don't think it does. Oh, we're actually losing down here now? As soon as I want to look away, we're going to start losing. I don't think so, man. I don't think so. How much do we need for this? 103? That's not bad. Because everything else we've pretty much scored already. Except for, uh... These little impassable terrain places. Man, these guys are really going at us. Really going nuts. But it's good for defense. Let's see. Demand demilitarization. Hold on. Wait, so what would, what would we go to then? Nothing? You just want factories? You greedy little pieces of garbage? We can't lower our conscription level. There's, we can't go any lower than what we already have. Let's grab some of this too. Since we're already using it. Might as well. 40%, 50%. Better planes. It's time for Cass. Good old Cass. I love Cass. Like it's a black sun. Wait, black sun. Uh, oh, know hello. Assassin City. That's a that's a big country you want to kill off there, Assassin City. That might be a little bit crazy, at least in my mind. We got some tribal pride though. We like the tribal pride. More heart attack piercing. Bomb vulnerability. That seems okay, but we gotta get it done anyway, so I'm not, let's just get through it. Good. Man, they are they're literally killing their own men off to the point where they can't fill in their losses. Which is great, don't get me wrong. That sounds great to me. We lost, what, 100, 200, 300 guys versus 2,700 guys? Not bad. Not bad. Cool. Alright, they stopped attacking until, well, they attack again, probably. There they go. Can two divisions hold out against seven? Well, let's make it a little more even. Serpentine Dockyards are Great Uroboros Dam. By beginning work on a great dam for the city of Uroboros at the northern neck of the Colorado, we can control the fate of thousands of tribals living downstream, or organization, monthly population, recruitable population factor, and max factories in a state. Very good. Wow, one division is probably not good enough to help hold, but they're doing a pretty good job regardless. Now, if we started attacking, that probably wouldn't go super well. Probably. But we'll let them continue doing what they need to do. Come on, keep going, guys. You're doing a great job. Only 3,000 dead, only 3,100 dead? Come on, guys. You can do better than this. Because if I try to attack eight divisions there, it's not going to go well. Uh, actually, how many ships do they have? We might consider doing a naval invasion. Kazal's Legion is... You know, let's go to one Kazal's Legion. 
They have double the docks or the shippies. Hmm. There's what we could do though. Gliders. Well, capture the one. Hello. Pause it because I don't want to lose. The, that's up over there. I don't know why it goes up to 60. Just go down to 50. I want you to specifically work on blowing up the enemy's navy. Well, you can do that too, I guess, if you really wanted to. Overall blues, that kind of sucks. Whatever. And let's grab some... Ouroboros. I forget. What do we do? Grenades? Let's go with inflamers. We're cooking, cooking up a storm here. Gator Maws. Very nice. Can't afford anything else. We gotta get a trade node. We really gotta get to uh, New Canaan, but... See what happens. Oh, oh, we have our own faction, Daughters of Ekate. Very nice. All right, once those guys leave, they'll attack again. Do we have any ship confirmations? Just in case, let's grab another airbase here, painted rock. Good. And then do it down here as well. We're gonna need planes for dead horses. Oh, good. More special forces. Good. Aids clear one east port. Oh, we can call more stuff too. Uh, maybe not that one. This one though. There we go. We only need 81, so very soon. So we got two divisions here. We have the Great Urboros Dam. And we should do mechanical servants. Over the years, robots traveling from the north have made their way into our lands. They've made great servants, helping us build Uroboros to this great city it is today. We got a whole one civilian workshop. Wow. How great. Two holding at consist mate. Go ahead and go on in. This feels like Victoria too. You bait the enemy into attacking your lines, and then you send in the reinforcements. Nice. Here goes painted rock. Now, if we try to attack over the river, it probably won't go super well. For example, we could try it right now. 27. Probably drops to 20. Well, 54. It might drop even more. Monoplane attackers. Thank you very much. Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe it's going up to 55. I mean, they don't have any more real good resources to use, but capture the Lost Souls Bunker? How sad. How sad. It'd be a very costly attack. That's alright. That's what they're there for. 50. That's not bad. Go up to 100 now. Deception tactics? Good. Mm, let's get some more output. Output's always useful. It is slowly going up. Well, it was. We've only killed off 4,000, probably some. Yeah, almost 4,000, so. Oh, and it's slowly going back down. How big sad. Well, if you don't let it move, you should do okay, right? And even more radar, because we can. 53, getting a little bigger. 54, good. Get more organization for these guys, good. Force the attack. That infantry division is tired. I did want to naval invade, but it looks like we might be able to actually get over here. As long as they can reinforce their own divisions too well with manpower, so I'm not too worried about it. Flamethrowers, nice and hot. That's how we like them. Get even more soft attack for this campaign. Sometimes I choose the other one just because it's 2% more soft attack compared to the other selection. was like 3% more soft attack and heart attack and reliability or something like that. It's okay. It's alright. Not great. Now they just attacked us. Can you win by attacking yourselves? Well, don't attack yourself, but, you know, just attack. Mechanical servants, cool. Dark moon, set trees. Please put down your weapons. You have 20 seconds to comply. Wow, we need more money, too. Oh, actually, how is our, how's our money looking? Oh, that's not good. All right, then. No more divisions. Minus four. Well, those two divisions we made. Bye-bye. That helps out a little bit, but we can't afford any more, so. We're kind of capped out. Come on. Force the attack. you got to break over. They literally have no more manpower, so. Once the game lied to me. They might have three guys, but that's all they got, man. That's all they got. Especially their special forces aren't doing so well, either. So, yeah.
Keep going, Special Forces. The air damage should be stupendous. You know what? Let's get even another one here, too. It shouldn't take too long to build. If we can't have a bigger army, we'll just have a bigger air force. Richard Wright, you are level 3 now. You should be getting better and better every time you do this. Uh, just please don't tell me that they are getting more manpower, please. Oh my goodness, come on. Come on. By the time we're done with this war, we'll probably be at war. We go to war with the dead horses. Well, maybe not. Hold on. We're, we might be breaking through here. We might be making headway. Akate, do you have anything with us? No? Alright, it's cool. Have we caught every single piece of territory that we've gotten? Yes, we have. Wow, look at that. That's pretty nice. That's pretty darn nice, I'd say. But money. National Guard. I definitely don't want to lose any more attacks, so. Next centuries. Uh, War Machines of the Goddess. Dead or alive, you're coming with me. Even more workshops. Very good. Well, Fuel Boy. War Industrialist. Because I don't care about the whole opinion thing. That's fine. That's okay with me, but. Not too interested in it. Cool, but I will be right back. My apologies about that, but I had to use the restroom. But regardless, frugality has escaped us, and this is what we reap. Also, I just deleted four divisions just in case, and now we're at 0.35 caps. Our economic advisors are reporting that some extremely troubling news. Due to recent spending sprees, our coffers are depleted, and indeed, our current income wasn't enough to offset our expenses, and as a result, we burned through our surplus funds too quickly. It's safe to say that we are currently suffering from minus 1.7 stability and other things, and a host of other terrible effects that have come from our horrible fiscal situation. It's absolutely imperative that we put our efforts towards solving this crisis and getting our economy back on track. If we let this issue worsen for much longer, there's truly no telling what will happen to any of us. Heck, our people could even revolt against us. It's not good. Dip into the emergency funds? Oh, well, thank you. I'll gladly take some emergency funds and we'll be refining scrap. With a growing industrial base, the demands for raw metals increases. To meet the growing demand, we should commission foundries that can make scrap into usable metal. We've lost about 800. Investment falling through, cut our losses. I don't remember making an investment, but yeah. What the heck? Yeah, definitely not right now, especially with little money, the little money that we don't have. I don't remember even making an investment, and yes, I know attacking using force attack is not a good idea, but they're still going to just go in and try to do whatever we can. We see some scare package, that's pretty worthless right now for us. Ooh, yeah, pretty much. It's just, I just wish they would be able to break across. That's why fighting over here is not always a great idea. I mean, it is what it is, but, but at this point, Richard Wright, you should have been able to break over by now. I mean, look how weak their divisions are. Redonculus, I'd say. Come on, get over here. No escaping. I've got plenty of manpower, though. They have 13 divisions. No manpower still. This is why... I got, well, the reason I keep using this force attack on special forces is because, well, they're special forces. They should be able to do whatever we need to get done, right? They're special. Okay, they keep making more divisions or something. What the heck? Uh, Stim packs, that's not bad. Doggos would be good. Let's grab some of this. More focus fire would be good as well. Maybe start focusing a little bit more on our air doctrine too, since we do already have a bunch of air XP, so. My goodness. Look how weak that division is. Look how weak it is. Look how weak it is. Oh my goodness. They have some anti tank, which is good for them, but hmm. We already have some radar here too, which is good. Do we have any bigger things around here maybe maybe get some monoplane attackers some cast perhaps that'd be kind of nice right last patrol to clear one of the choctaw nation now this should put, give us the advantage that we need at taking out these enemies yes a little bit more just a tiny smidgen more it looks like we might just finally be able to break over the river just oh come on don't let them in look how weak they are look how weak they are so weak such weakness wow Old memes. Oof. Big sad. But, regardless, let's help us get through our focus tree. Besides, who else are we going to take out? Black Canyon? Not yet. Fabricate electronics. As it turns out, there's a lot more to industry than just emptying our workshops and refined metal. It's imperative that a section of our industrial sector is dedicated to fabricating electronic devices. Cool. And we already did this one's equipment study. Let's grab local innovation, get more output. We, can make, we could use more planes, right? Absolutely. Come on, come on, come on. Just just break over. How, how can they withstand all these attacks? So many attacks. We have the best attacks. 18. That's a lot of that's a lot of ground to support. Holy cow. And they can still Oh, come on. Oh, we were so close. We were like 96 there. So close. 
Seriously, are they, they gotta be making more divisions. It can't be just 13, man. It can't be just 13. They have 8 infantry, so 16 combat width, and they have 20 combat width for that. Hmm. Oh, happy 2280, everyone. Yeah, breaking over the river sucks, but this will help us push over and actually get to Lanius eventually, so that's good. I know it's a bad idea, but just keep forcing the attack. How can they hold out with those weak... Look at that. That's so... mm, they must have mobilized. They must have mobilized, and every time they retreat, they get a little bit more strength back. Which really does suck, but there's not really much we can do about it. Chief of the Air Force. Let's come over here. Cam Pusher. Well, not core manpower. I guess if we have to choose one, that's a pretty good one to use, even though we don't really get its benefits too much right now. So, Even this one's looking better now than this one at times. Look how weak they are. So weak. I should get some more uh, stuff over here. Is there anything else we could throw on our divisions? No, there literally is nothing else. We already have the demo teams. If I could throw in a second set of demo teams, that'd be kind of nice. Yeah, why not? Why can't we throw a second thing of demo teams on? That'd be kind of fun. I'd say. Kind of fun. I mean, our air XP is going up pretty nicely. Focus fire, not bad. Incinerators would be nice and all. Let's go and grab some. Reinforce rate. That'd be good. I mean, seriously, come on. This is so dumb. This is incredibly stupid. Please, just give up. Come on, 96. Move, move, move your butts. Thank you. Oh my goodness, we finally broke over. The walls of our borough cell. We will keep an, an, any enemy out of our borders. Strike them down, rain on them with arrows and bullets and everything else we can muster. Not bad. At this point, I'm having you just terminate with extreme prejudice. I don't even care at this point. Screw all you guys. You all come right here, right now. And do this. Just kill every single one of them. You're not leaving, son. You're, mo you're marching in. You're going to exterminate with extreme prejudice. Oh my goodness. And better radar. Might as well. Oh man, if I... Force the attack for the infantry too. I don't care. Just force it. We've lost way too many guys dealing with these people. Oh, if only they had redemption. Oh well. Uh, let's get some more ground attack. I love the ground attack. Good, overrun them. They don't deserve life. Good. Upper Colorado. Well, once the war's over, we'll split these guys up a little, a little bit better. That'd be good. Alright, up next. Because we're running out of... Uh, Electricity, which is not very good. Oh, you help out right here. You gotta go, 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 go. Seriously, how do they still have six divisions? They should have died years ago. Years. Oh, these guys are cut off. That's good. Good, kill them. Take the riches. Riches. Wait, reduce. I'd, well, I, mean, I guess we technically we could demobilize, but we can't lower our conscription level. That makes no sense. Well, that took way too long. That took way longer than I thought it would. My bad. That's all right. We we're already good to war with these guys anyway, so could be worse. Lost about a thousand, but we already still have sixteen and a half thousand in reserve. I do apologize for that taking quite a while, though. But that does give us time to get more political power, so that we can core these areas more quickly once they are ready. If it's really worth it. Actually, that's pretty much. That's actually really worth the core of that piece of territory. And in 18 days, we'll have another focus. But first, local innovation. We should replace that with... Ooh, construction speed's not bad. Ah, get more construction speed. Communal projects. I like building construction. Factory repair speed, not bad. Civilian factory repair stuff. I like the communal projects. Up next, after that, is a well-rounded industry. Between our harvesting this Colorado of all of its potential, and the construction of a durable and varied industrial base, I guess we just didn't finish our focus tree description here. Our focus description. Stonks, hey, look at this. We're all like to read about that. Go right ahead, but because that happens every campaign. 150 caps. Better consumer goods, more max factories, more output, less resources to market, and scientific construction tech. Not bad. I, well, I'll gladly take that. But actually, you know what? We're not doing that yet. I want to go to war with these guys. Dead horse raid. Finally, we can establish dominion on the southern bank of Utah. With this territory invading into Kaiser's Legion will be truly possible. Finally. Finally, we can do that. How much money do we make now? 0.35 still. Not bad. It's better than not making enough money. Actually, you guys should actually be able to all attack. At least we have four divisions around here. That's actually really good. Alright, so we're done attacking like crazy. Y'all come here. 
There you go. Yeah, that was a that was a wild war. Too much war. Too much. Not, not enough war. Not enough, but too much craziness for that war. How's Diana doing? Actually, she's still she's still holding out. Oh man, how's that war going? Diana lost once. She is she gonna lose again? Now uh, there's the uh, Oklahoma war. There it is. Ten thousand. Jesus, for one thirteen hundred. That's oh my goodness. Wow. Very good. How strong are these guys? Oh, the white legs do have claims on them. They that's in a thousand man. That's not bad. We have eighty-eight factories too. Uh, well, actually, if we do this, going we we have to go to war with the white legs, just because I need New Canaan as that trade post or the trade node, whatever we call it. That's gonna be super important. I can't make any more divisions, so we're gonna have to make some land forts around here. We're already making some factories or infrastructure, I should really say, which is great and all, but yeah, we're gonna need we're gonna need more than that. Hmm, I think that should be good enough. One, two, three, four. It's kind of hard to see. Let's see. So we got one, two. Oh, right here too. Yeah, definitely put those there. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. That should be good enough since we don't really have a land border with them up there, so. And which pathway are the white legs going, actually? Offensive armaments are new. Hmm. Our new master. Okay. Sure, why not? Why not? So we're done with this for now. Let's get some more drop tanks for range. That'd be pretty good to do. After long range radio, we're going to go ahead and grab aerial warfare. That's yeah, 90% done. Yep, stop it. Stop it. What are you doing? Cool. Dead horse raid. I'd say this is a little bit more than a raid. I'm not going to lie. A little bit more than a raid. But let's go and do go back over here and do this one. Well-rounded industry, finally. All right. Let's go ahead and go to warp. Do this quickly. Oh my goodness. This might end us getting into the war against the Legion as well as the White Legs at the same time if we're not smart about this. Actually, you guys. Y'all doing okay? During that entire time, I did not give you any planning? What the heck is wrong with me? Well, all I can say is I'm glad I'm building up Land Forts right now because, oh my goodness. I'm ne I've never seen them with that flag, I think. Maybe Militus Altioris? Bad words. They did join the Legion. Bad words. A lot of bad words. They going to attack all of Utah? Why does it have to be Utah, man? Why does it have to be Utah? So we got to move th through this quickly. And then we have to guard the waterways around here, too. You're going to force the attack again. Richard Wright, I mean, you're going to get injured a lot as a general. Just saying. You better be ready for it. Cool. And we better be ready for the these guys, too. So keep building, keep building, 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 building. we got plenty of manpower. we got plenty of industry. I think we'll be doing pretty okay. Good. Cut them. If we can cut these guys off, that'd be great. All right, guys. I'm I'm going to need you guys to force the attack. I really need you to do that for us. There we go. Dead horses will be ours. Dead horses point, I should say. UT95. Cool. And we'll have that soon enough. Fossil. We got him. And now we're going to have to hold on for the rest of our lives because even though we wanted to fight Lanius. We'll probably end up fighting the entire legion, including the white legs. Jesus Christ, this is going to be tough. Uh, heart attack and piercing, you might as well. All right, so how are we going to divide this up? New cannon are down here. Not bad. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, five. We're going to have at least ten divisions guarding that. Just going to do that too. Five. But we got to also contend with all this stuff too. There's nothing over there, so five. Really, if it's five, we gotta have at least ten in total. So I can split half of you guys up, maybe. And half of you guys come right there. Well, actually. We'll probably actually modify that a little bit more. Four divisions, for the love of God, you gotta hold out right there. Actually, that might not be bad to, too bad. There you go. We need three to four divisions. Well, I think that's. Yeah, we need more divisions. That's not gonna be enough. You guys. This is going to be rough. This is going to be really rough. Malvin Moore. One. Let's see, what do we got? Anything around here? No, that's good. One. Two. Well, that's actually not too bad. Three. Any other place that these guys need to go? 
Doesn't look like it. Faction map mode. Oh, this is, that's dangerous close. Maybe we should not take out the foragers. But I think we'll be okay. Any other hole here that we have to cover up? Hopefully not. Hopefully we have enough, because I can't make any more soldiers. If that's the case, you guys will come right there. And you guys are going to come right there, because you guys can kind of share this area here, so that'd be fine. This is not going to be easy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh man. And we'll go with it rooted. That'll be good. So after this, after well-rounded industry, do we have another tech coming along? Yes, four days. Side channel tech. We'll go ahead and grab some pulse code modifications, or modulations, I should really say. It's not too bad. And there we go. Cool. So, sit list lunar sisters at last. Diana seems that has held true to her belief in the power of kindness and goodness by standing up to Lanius. Let us give her a proper home here and show her kindness for what she has done. They just joined our faction, the daughters of Ekate, in which hopefully she can help us in the war against the Legion. That would actually be pretty nice. Hopefully we don't actually have to give her land in exchange. I don't think we would, we would, but all she does is receive an invitation, which is hopefully all that she really wants or needs. So, yeah. Occupied territories, slowly going up. That's all right. I'll put over here. Can we go and core this? No, we cannot. Yeah, we might need to help them out at least a little bit. Who? Oh, God. White legs. I'm a little afraid of the white legs. Not going to lie. But if we can help these guys out, that would be pretty good. I'm glad we got this, too. That's nice. Anything else around here? Boom, boom, maybe. Maybe boom, boom up north. And by boom, boom, I mean put some uh, planes or air bases. Boom, boom. There you go. Boom, 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 boom. That's a lot of divisions. Holy crap. That's a lot of divisions. If I can get to Kriag, we could help kill those divisions off pretty quickly, though. And that would be quite bueno. Gliders. Go ahead and put the gliders over here. 11. I'll put them on the 5 one first. Duplicate it. And I'll put you on the 11 one just in case. There you go. Do we have a new. No, we, need, we, need, we definitely need more casts. Most definitely. Good. What is this? The birth of the Mesoamerican Alliance. The marriage of Clara from Chichen Itza and the ruler of Nueva Atsalan. I've never seen that before. Formidable alliance, to be sure. I have never seen that one before. Whoa. Let's grab some bricks. Bricks are nice. We finally discovered how to use bricks. That's nice. Holy cow. Really? Really? The jungle pack? I've never seen that before. And they even have Honduras in there, too. Wow, that is different. Let's grab some airbase raids. That'd be good. All right. Up next... We could lower that. Ah, uh, screw it. We'll grab this one just because we can. How often will we actually be able to do that? Mercenary training instructors? Why not? Slightly more organization. It's kind of nice. Hang dogs are doing relatively okay against Len. Yes. I like what they're doing. <coughs> Drop things are nice. Ooh. Air static, air damage, support. Let's get some, grab some more support stuff. I want to throw something else on our soldiers. I guess we could throw on these guys. Saws. They're okay. They're not bad. Not my first pick. Well, I'll, I'll use them. We'll use them. Keep building, folks. Because once the war starts, it's going to be a mess. Oh, we got a little bit of money. Can we actually raid for realsies? Natural disasters. The country has experienced a great hail. From reports on the ground, it seems that the death cloud chai sunks chunks <clears throat> of glowing eyes fell from the sky. Onto fields, roads, some shacks, and a statue of our founder. People are requesting or requesting relief for pain, suffering, or isolated anxiety. What can we spare? Uh, <clears throat> nothing to spare. Sorry. Cool. We'll tribute tributize. Can I tributize Kaiser's Legion? That'd be kind of funny. Life for ooh, border war, Black Canyon. They're all pretty weak. <clears throat> we could try them because it there's only six there, so we could try it. Tribute ties, big guns, big money. They rejected us. Well, kind of saw that one coming. Mm, can't do that. Can't. Uh, has to be after 2081. I don't understand why we have to wait that long. So we did all this. Well, let's go do engine developments. The beats of burden can only take us so far technologically. In the interest of auto something automation, we've decided to funnel some of our efforts into homegrown engine design. Oh, there you go. They want us to go to war with them. I wanted to raid them. Gosh dang it. Fine. 
Oh, glow bugs too, yeah. Go ahead. If we can get to Kriag, like I said before, that should be pretty good. Nice. Exterminate with extreme prejudice. Holy crap, this is like 12 divisions down here. 12 plus 23... 26. 12 plus 26 is 38 divisions. We basically circled the entire army. Wow. That is sad. That is so sad. Not really. We didn't like them anyways. But at least they joined us. Hopefully we get it. Someone did say that we don't get an event when we reclaim the other lands for Diana back, so we'll see what happens. IED training? Sounds good to me. Sounds very good. Ah, very, very good. Yeah, seriously, did they literally put all their divisions over to kill off Diana? That's so stupid. No, not all of them, but a lot of them they did. <clears throat> Big dumbs, I'd say. Big dum dumbs. Big num nuts. Let's grab that. That's good. Wow. Just, just wow. 20 divisions. Holy cow. Cypher's done for the landing score. Oh, actually, we have this one. I should have used that earlier. Gosh darn it, Mr. Muckle Lover. What is wrong with you? Oh, we can do this. Um, just cancel it. Gosh darn it. Well, I guess your goal is to get all the way down to Boulder. That'd be pretty good. Last good adjustments was annexed. Cool. Ah, little snake. Little, 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 little snake. Engine development. What's the next thing down here? After engine development, robotic development. With genes as fine as these, it is a darn shame to have some of our population doing housework, cleaning, or being left on guard duty. We should supplant these mundane roles with new robotic servants. We probably should. And we don't have a lot more energy cells. We should probably build some... What is it? Power stations, I think, if I remember correctly? Power stations. Well, they, they would be nice, right? That'd be pretty nice. There we go. Yeah, we should probably get that next. You guys are not done. Like, you you barely started. You gotta keep going, guys. Come on. Vamanos. I could pull soldiers off the line, but now we gotta do this quickly. Even though Diana probably has this done. Oh, they were at war with... Oh, crap. Alright, last time I used LMGs. Let's go with some of this stuff this time. Oh, crapperinos. Well, at least it's really only one more tile there, so that's not too bad. I just hope that these guys don't die, so that'd be really bad if they did. Uh, so these guys are cut off too, that's nice. Airbase raids are pretty good. More ground attack, that'd be awesome. Oh, look at that, encircled, nice. Good job, guys. Come on, we gotta finish this war off soon. Seriously, are they, are they just rushing divisions out or something? Oh no, these are the glow bug divisions, that's, what, that's what's up. Oh, there's quite a bit of lag. What's going on? Hey, the Legion is broken apart. Actually, this is a perfect time to attack. <clears throat> but my armies are busy. Oh, why do they have to be busy? Is this all the cores of Diana? I mean, if she wants it, she can have it. <clears throat> my goal is just to kill off the Legion. And we'll have to kill off the White Legs first, but hey, that's just me. And we're out of energy cells. Gosh darn it. Well, next research. I know what we're doing today. Resource production. Very good. Recent natural disaster sucks, but whatever. Come on, guys. Let's keep going. You know what? You can even force attack and probably do well. Get to Saratoga. We don't have to capitulate. Oh, we do have to capitulate them. Oh, glow bugs. Buggerinos. Good. Good, Saratoga is ours. But still not enough. Really? We've only lost actually 121. That's not bad. They're almost gone. They're so close. So close. Okay, we got them. 
I'm not really sure if we should give this all to Diana, but I'm going to give it to her anyways just because she probably deserves it. If anything, we could probably take stuff later on if take it away from her, but I want to see what happens if we actually give it to her. Cool. Now, let's set ourselves up over here. Now it's going to hurt our manpower, probably. Watch for spies, protect his legacy. Cool. Permanent reduction in coring costs, that's good. So hopefully all that will be good. The Dark Moon. Huh. Robotic development is always nice. Keeping a sharp. Ah, great description. Oro keeping sharp desk. Might as well. I'm obviously avoiding the last couple land uptrends down south. But, hey, you know what? I guess as soon as we can, we'll just go to war if possible. Actually, are you guys fighting someone else? Where are you? Oh, you're... Ooh! Oh my goodness, hold on. What's going on? Just in case, I'm going to manually justify on these guys. If they're going to go to war with the 80s, or the 80s going to go to war with them, that is the perfect time to strike. Yeah, they're justifying on the eight on the 80s, so that's good. We could sandwich the white legs, kill them off, then focus on the legion. This is actually turning out not too bad. Hopefully. I hope I don't eat those words. I really, really don't. Tax them? Yeah, tax them. Read a man tribute. Oh, uh, yeah, I think, of course they would probably reject us. Tax whoever we can to get more money, because, oh my goodness, 521 is not enough. In the meantime, can we core this? Yes, we can. Good. Keep coring all these areas down here. Not bad. IED training. Recovery rate goes up. Good. Now we're looking pretty good on everything, except fire teams. We make more fire teams. Now we need more factories, period. Oh boy. Thank goodness that natural recent disaster is over, though. Oof. Resource production, good. Let's grab some basic generators, that'd be awesome. Focus a little bit more on this stuff. I mean, eventually we'll, we'll build everything around here, because we're going to run out of things to build eventually anyway, so... Good. And incinerators. I uh, love more soft attack. There we go. Let's see. Broken tributes. Whatever. Yeah, not bad. Let's see. Can we throw those on already? Because we might as well throw them on. Yeah, well, I guess we have no, not enough army XP. Makes sense. Let's grab some of this. Yeah, if they go to war with those guys, then we'll go to war. If not, then we'll wait just a little bit. We'll just wait. A little bit. Not too long. Keeping sharp, and then the other half. As the old proverb goes, knowing is half the battle. But how much can we can we truly know without a dedicated intelligence service? About as much as Socrates, by our judgment. We should remedy this shortfall immediately. Should have waited to do my upgrades. So Maybe. Eh, it's alright. Anything here? We couldn't take the focus yet just because it's not even 2281 yet. But hey, not bad. Not bad, actually. Actually. Oh, they're all part of. The, they're all part of the Legion, huh? Sons of Kaisar. Vulpus's Legion. The Conquest of New Canaan. Well, alright then. Good luck with that. I don't think New Canaan's here anymore, but hey, whatever. They have a lot of divisions, though. Holy cow. They don't have that much manpower. Which is a very, very, very good thing. 95. Actually, how is resistance down here? It's not very populated, so it, make it makes it easier for us to core areas. Yeah, that'd be nice. That'd be very good. 105 factories, not bad. Keep making more stuff. How are we looking? We got plenty of things. Oh, crud. I forgot about this. Uh, keep one up there, too. That's fine. We should be able to make these factories fast enough. Over here, we have well, not a bad amount of ports. Really not bad. Oh, maybe, of course, something else, perhaps? Gotta keep as much manpower as possible, because there's gonna be a lot of resistance we gotta put down. A lot of resistance. And there goes the Sons of Kaiser. How sad. Good God, I don't wanna fight these guys. Oh my goodness. But Diana will help us, right? Diana will totally help us. Quarterly report income. Same amount. Hmm. Other half. 
Like, so how far are they done? Are they, are, can they actually go to war yet? Oh! Oh, crap, they're justifying on, on those guys too? Oh, there goes Aurelius' the, the legion. They can go to war with the Aes, which I'm pretty sure they will eventually. So, <clears throat> hopefully... In the beginning there was a word. Hopefully... They do end up going to war with the 80s before they go to war with the Lone Trees. Because I just don't have enough divisions to put over there as well. Which is going to suck biggies. I mean, I, I could probably pull off two divisions here to defend up there, but... That's kind of pretty gosh darn tight. Just in case. I guess we could throw two things up there. The other half? Nice. And then Final Revenge. It's been a long time coming. Oh, we just straight up go to war with them. They're not even a war goal. Alright, well... We'll see what happens. We'll see that too. Uh, where are our air bases? Everyone's got to have a little bit of cast. And by a little bit, I mean a lot. Cool. Take you. Come here. Take you. Come here. Oh yeah, you definitely need it right there. Uh, if we got another 100 planes, that's fine with me. We, we're going to need them. Mm. We're going to need a lot of planes. Come on, 80s. Go to war with them. Go to war with them. Please, 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 please. Organ oh, that's nice. More organ Just a flat, more organization. Awesome. Let's grab some of this, because even though we don't really need it too much, it's still pretty good to get. Final revenge, and we've gone to war, my friends. I think we'll pick this up, though, in the next episode. Regardless, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow. And go to war. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.